push forward another question of statistics. This is question number 3 from exercise 14.3, page 258 from NCRT. It says given below are the seats won by different political parties in the polling outcome of the state assembly elections. So political parties in my class get chain A, B, C, D, E, F. But how many of these seats are under GP and given as seats won? Now then, the first is draw a bar graph to represent the polling results. So how many of these bar graph to represent the polling results? So this is y axis, this is x axis, this is 0, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, and this is 80. So my pass the A, B, C, D, P, A, 6 parties and supports. This is A, this is B, this is C, D, E, and F. After some bar graph, we will get A box, A K D over. So, B how many given are political parties? And B given are, sorry, this is the seats one. Seats one. This is political party. So the relevant part, political party A, seventy-five seats. Seventy-five seats means in each we have to push value by the. So we need to box. So why not say A box? This is A. Then B is fifty-five. Fifty-five. Fifty to sixty के बीच में होगा. So fifty to sixty के बीच में this is B. Then C is 37. 37 which is the answer? This is C. Then B is 29. Which marker? Somewhere around here. This is 29. E is 10. 10 is this thing. And F is 37. 37 means which is the answer? That is This is the bar graph. In second, we can have which political party won the maximum number of seats. The maximum seats means here, Hala. This is political party A. So, political party A won the maximum maximum number of seats. So this was question number 3 from exercise 14.3 and do watch the next video for some more questions. Goodbye.